it would be it would be really nice if cavities could go away on their own. Unfortunately, that's not the way Mother Nature works. Cavity is a circumstance where there has been acid on the tooth. And what the acid does is it takes the mineral portion out of the tooth. That's the part that makes it hard. And it turns the tooth soft. The acid is produced by bacteria. The bacteria eat carbohydrates that you uh, take into your mouth and chew and, uh, and take in as, as uh, food. And some of that sticks around in your mouth. And the bacteria digest that and what comes out of the, uh, the bacteria, the byproduct, is acid. And when that sits on tooth structure, the effect is that the mineral of the tooth goes away. It's actually removed. And then you end up with something that's soft and mushy, and that's basically what a cavity is. Uh, the external surface of the tooth, the enamel, is that hard outer you know, armor plating. And that resists for a period of time on that acid. And if you are in a position where just some of the mineral has been removed, but most of it's still there, then it is possible to take, there are some products on the market that will help to remineralize it. The twist is, if you haven't lost it, any mineral, then it's not really doing anything. And if you've lost too much mineral, then it's, it's not capable of turning things around. So it's really helpful to have a dentist or hygienist look at the tooth and see what the status of it is. Oftentimes when you've lost some mineral, there's kind of a white or a brown you know, stripe or patch on that tooth that identifies that things have undergone some change. I, but an x-ray really will tell what, how much of that mineral has been lost. It's a better readout of that. The exterior surface of the tooth that can be seen on that x-ray, and if there's a little bit of sort of a cone sometimes of a shadow there, that tells you that things are starting up. If it goes all the way through the enamel and gets into the dentin, which is the interior layer of the tooth, then it's a full-blown cavity and there's nothing you can do that will remineralize that. Now it has to be treated. So you wanna catch things in their early stages and go as preventive as possible. So getting you know, follow-ups with your dentist, with your hygienist helps to make that happen and they can recommend a product that will help with that remineralization process. So the products that are generally involved in the remineralization process tend to need to be prescribed or recommended. So they're not something that you find you know, straight over the counter normally.